Greetings, fellow outsiders. Hopefully, uh, you're able to see me and hear me and see the game. I'm gonna I'm gonna hop into a new game. Um, cause I think what I want to try and do with this stream is get all of the sparkles. We get to see Benjamin again. Also, I don't know if you can see it that well, but I put little sparkles on my face so that I can be like little Miss Fortune. Happiness to the chat. The rules of this game are simple. Play it until the end and you'll be rewarded. Okay. Whatever you say, Mr. Voice. Did he skip the humble narrator? <laughs> Something I wanted to point out with this that I thought was cool is she's playing with dolls. This is Fortune. And when the time loop starts she's a again, wonderful child from a not so wonderful family. Benjamin drops one of the dolls in there, like in this play a area. For you, and a little sparkle for you, and, and a, a little, little bit, bit for me. me. Oh, I love her so much. The sad part is, today <laughs> is the day she will die. Oh, thank you so. I love, I love Little Miss Fortune. Uh, I can hear you, you know. Oh, you can. She is mm -hmm. too cute. Are you inside my head or something? <laughs> hmm. Well, okay. Yes. Same place as Franbo. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm gonna play that I'll next. Call you, Mr. Voice. What did you say about me dying today? Die? No. Nobody said anything about anyone dying today. I uh, I know it's crucial nothing. to the story. You know, I have prepared a game for you. A game? Really? I feel really? bad talking over the narrator. <laughs> Even though I shouldn't. He's a mean. Game, He's a meanie. I'll give you eternal happiness. <laughs> Deal? Eternal happiness? I guess I could give that to my mommy. Okay, it's a deal. Wonderful. So... Fantastic. Ready to play? Yes. Your first mission is to leave the house. Give me a minute to okay. finish the... I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. Okay, so what that tells me, <laughs> that little flash, for those of you who... So I'm I'm gonna be talking about this game. So for those of you who have not seen the ending to my first playthrough, um, or are not like would like to see that at some point, I'm gonna be saying many spoilers now, <laughs> since it's my second time playing through, and I want to like notice new things. That tells me that like this game that we're playing is the game, if that makes sense. Like there's no way to save Misfortune by just staying here because we already saw the flash from the other side. Someone also told me because Benjamin had a thing that said, signed the deal. Someone in the comments said that the deal could be when she says deal at the very beginning. When he's like, do you want to play a game? And she's like, deal. And then it's, she's, you know, signed off. So. <laughs> My glitter. Her glitter. <laughs> I need to start carrying around glitter. Although glitter, Oh, press Y to throw glitter. How do I do it again? There we go. Yay. There's another scene with the hamsters in the cane. Yeah, I think I made, I don't outlaw, I think I made the wrong choice the last time. Um, like I made the, <laughs> I made the hamsters kiss. Hiding spot. Oh, impressive. But why do you need a hiding spot? I don't like it when mommy and daddy argue too much. And when I come here, I can dream and travel far away. I see. <laughs> <laughs> She's literally too I cute. I love my coloring book. Uh, take coloring book with us. Oh, okay. Does this have a bearing on the story? I remember we used it in the train when we were coming home. But I don't know that it does anything specific. I don't know how it would do it. Do completely different choices? Okay. Leave it. Just leave it here for Bobsy, you know, the teddy. The teddy. <laughs> okay. Um, this is Bobsy, the guardian of the secret spot. You see his eye? He got that from a battle against a monster. A monster? That sounds scary. It was. I'm I'm realizing now too. Right behind Bobsy, there's a sticker that says Ninja. <laughs> so we get a little like foreshadowing, I guess. <laughs> Of it, so don't let her go outside. She's all in. <laughs> well, 
What? This is my diary. Nobody Hold on, give me one second. To read it. Want to see? That's the meta thing with games like this. Is like when it does the the time loop. This is such an interesting thing with like time loops and games that it's it's like playing the game or like the only way to save misfortune is to like not play. I think. Right? So it's like it, it becomes a little bit meta, which it's already meta because the, the narrator breaks the third, uh, the fourth wall, the third wall, <laughs> the fourth wall by talking to us. Before you leave, which toy do you choose to bring with you? Can't I take them both? No, you can only choose one. And remember, your choice is much more important than you think. Okay. I choose. Okay, so since we're going with the opposites, we are going to stone. I choose the stone that he threw at me once. Interesting choice. Yeah, I call him Stony because. He's oh wait, a I just registered what she said. Stony the stone. That's very clever. Thank you. Oh my God, I was reading chat, and <laughs> everyone was being so nice to me. Oh my god, Stony! Stony the stone! Okay. Well. Ah, and so you know, I like to sprinkle sparkle on things so they become fabulous. I know, Miss Fortune. Shut up! Oh, <laughs> happiness to everything! Happiness to everything! Hey, you, on the other side of the screen. I don't want to talk to Remember you. Remember, I told you she was going to die today. You're a meanie. a secret us all right you're acting as if i oh benjamin's in the window did you guys see that <laughs> benjamin someone pointed that out to me in the comments too it was so cool uh benjamin walks by the window at the very end of that sequence it's so freaking cool i don't think there's any way not to break this damn it it's all broken now <laughs> that was a beautiful example of cause and effect Please don't tell on me. Don't worry. You can trust me. Okay, thank you. <laughs> All right, let's look at the wedding picture. Mommy said she married daddy because she was expecting me. She wanted to have an abortion, but it's illegal and against the law. That's kind of the same thing. <laughs> yes. I said this in the first time I played through it. So since we're doing the opposite, I'm not gonna fix the um, the thing this time. I'm just gonna leave it. But um, Miss Fortune knows knows too much about the world. Like <laughs> she knows way too much compared to like what a eight year old probably should know about the world and like adult things. I guess is is what I'm trying to say. So yep, we're leaving the vase this time. Someone said that the voice is her dad. I, I don't know how I feel about that theory, because, like, I see how it could make sense, but at the same time, I don't know. Because, like, Mr. Voice also is, according to Benjamin, like, otherworldly, and I'm not sure that her dad is otherworldly or just mean. Um, I mean, it could, like, be, like, metaphor, you know what I mean? Like, storytelling in that way. Because um, he, he does seem like a father figure to her for most of the game. Um, so... Go back and interact with the wedding picture? Smells like cigarettes in here. Yeah, that's my mommy. She also likes to drink juice a lot. <laughs> well, are you ready to complete your first mission? Yes, I am. I'm gonna get that price. Um, okay. Mommy, this smells really bad. What is it? Dead animals. That's what it is. Yikes forever. <laughs> Yikes forever. All right. <laughs> Happiness to the soup! I feel like I'm gonna be saying that forever now. Glitter soup, yeah. Well, <laughs> that reminds me of one of the funny lines that Mr. Boy says later, um, where he's like, why did I choose this girl? I saw her eating glitter. Who does that? So we saw it, we see it in action right now with her putting glitter into the soup. Uh, tell my mommy we're leaving. Okay, so this time do we say no? Does this affect the ending? Don't tell her. All right, we're doing the opposite, so. We go quiet, okay? Bye-bye. Good day, morning. 
It's afternoon, Miss Fortune. Ah, okay. Good afternoon, morning. Good afternoon, morning. <laughs> <laughs> she is too cute. All right, let's go. And there's a crow already Remember here. Remember Benjamin the fox? This is where I first saw him. He was hiding in the trash and we made eye contact. It was really intense. <laughs> yes, you told me about that fox already. You shouldn't trust the fox. They're all criminals. What? A fox criminal? <laughs> That's silly. A fox criminal. Oh, someone did point out, I forget who it was that commented this, but they were like, um, it could be Swiper. <laughs> Swiper uh, from Dora the Explorer. <laughs> um, but I, I, I like Benjamin. I still like Benjamin. And if you've seen the full playthrough, then you know <laughs> Benjamin is a sweetie pie. <laughs> okay, can I do this? Yay! This is where Daddy often sleeps. So that's interesting. We never see Miss Fortune's dad. Ever. Hello, kitty. Here, come. <laughs> come, kitty. Kitty, kitty. Kitty! kitty Poor don't kitty. Go. Is the cat kitty. somehow related to I Mr. Boyce? I get to pet the sweet animal. <laughs> misfortune the oh a reference to mr midnight sorry i'm reading messages as i'm going um that's in the fran bow thing right so before we continue you need to know the rules of the game misfortune all right remember you will be given choices on your journey mm -hmm. there is no right or her. wrong <laughs> only consequences Okay, okay. Only consequences. When you beat the game, the prize of eternal happiness is yours. I'm ready. Your next mission is to cross this road. All right. I can do that. Look to the left. Look to the right. Any course? No. Okay, I'm going. I don't want to go. Can we just stay here and listen to the peaceful birds? I don't want to. <sighs> oh my goodness. <gasps> oh, I that's... Saw a monster. What monster? I didn't see anything. It was there. I saw it. It's probably just your imagination. Yeah, that's true. I have a very big one. Just keep going. We'll have so much fun. All right. <laughs> So that's definitely Morgo, right? Because it looked like him, the outline of him. Also, what is this game he plays? I'm still confused about the par uh, the parasite, like storyline. Like, does he just keep them trapped in a time loop forever? <laughs> I didn't. <laughs> I didn't notice the toilet paper on her shoe at the first time. <laughs> Glitter to the birds! Kill Monday Games presents. She's so optimistic. That's such a beautiful metaphor. I hate to get artsy. But she smiles through the rain. This little girl so much. <laughs> huh, I used a little sparkle back there. Anyway, where are we? We are in the park now, I think, right? Look, um, there's a puppy. Hello, puppy. What a cute party hat. Now focus, Miss Fortune. You have to make a very difficult choice regarding this puppy now. Be aware of the consequences. All right. Okay, so here's my question. 
I think we have two different things that we can do opposite this time. We can do the same thing we did, which is set it free this time, and then go to the beach, which is the opposite, or we can play with it now and see what happens, and then maybe, well, is it gonna still lead down the same path? I don't know, I'll leave it up to you guys. Play with the puppy and then, okay. All right, are we playing with it? Is that what we're doing? Play? I will play with it so we can share a nice time together. <laughs> Good choice. Now throw the ball at it. Maybe this, this time the crows won't take it. This ball. <laughs> that ball. Okay. Cause last time Mr. Voice took him. Oh my god! <laughs> no! Puppy! What did I do? It's all broken now. Mr. Voice, everything I touch breaks. What's wrong with me? There's nothing wrong with you. Sometimes life is just unfair, but I'm <sighs> here for you. Really? Thank you. Well, sadly, the puppy will miss the party now. What party? The owner of this dog, George, is having a party. I think you have to go and tell him about the accident. I'm what so mad. Ah, uh, yes, the puppy, yes. Let's go. It's just a bit farther ahead. All right. Oh my god, he's flat. We flattened him. It's flat Stanley now. Oh my. Glitter to the. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god okay i'm mad at mr voice oh the party hat i'll take the party hat as a symbol of our friendship oh doggy <laughs> puppy doggy <laughs> all right it's so sad it's the only reason i'm not more sad is because it looks so goofy <laughs> Is that bad? It like looks so unrealistic. It's just like pancake. <laughs> it's like, anyway. <laughs> so Mr. Voice is just straight up evil because he did that. He brought the the uh, crows over the first time and then he gave us the ball the second time. So, Miss Fortune, at the other side of this lake, you will be one step closer to the prize of eternal happiness. And the party, right? Ah, yes, that too. Why are there so many trees cut down in the background, I'm realizing? You know, once at this lake, I got my head stuck in a plastic bag. I remember falling asleep and waking up in the hospital. <laughs> That's terrible. Yeah, I almost died. Sparkle. How do I give the sparkle? I know that I needed to do sparkle here. Oh, can I not do sparkle here? I thought I could. The last time I played, I could do sparkle here. Uh. What? Uh, what's happening? I think you're in big trouble, Miss Fortune. Yeah, tell me about it. Where are these birds taking me? I have no idea. Like so the birds do something about it fast steal us first how to break loose kick the <laughs> sorry <laughs> i think you gotta i think you know what choice i gotta choose mommy told me once if guys are annoying me i should kick them in the balls oh my god and i asked where are these balls and she said between the legs all right that sounds like a plan <laughs> All right, here I go. Ball kick. <laughs> oh my god, iconic! <laughs> Can I save her? How do I save her? Ugh, this is taking a long time. <laughs> we this didn't so even cute. go that high up. Well, time seems to slow down when we are in danger. Am I in danger? Oh my god, it's the bird! Hey look, a bird! Hello, birdie! Hello, birdie! Oh, that was a rude bird. 
Oh god, so we got a whole new sequence. Why didn't I break my legs in that? Mm, you seem very good at falling. Thank you. <laughs> Can I go back at all? No. She just keeps walking. So, Mr. Voice, is the oh, man. the same way to the eternal happiness? Yes. Yes, it is. Oh, that's convenient. Have you thought about how to break the news to George? About the puppy? Yes. I mean, if you want to. Tell George about the puppy accident. So we chose yes the last time. So if I'm doing the opposite, we're going with no. No, I don't want to get in trouble. And I really want to dance at the party. All right, then. Oh, look, a boat. A boat. Hello. <laughs> Are we there yet? Just a little bit farther away. Ah, OK. Rodrigo! Oh. Ah, a fish. What should we do about it? What should we do about the fish? Release it or bring it bring it with us? Okay, so should we... Uh, here's another crossroads that I will send to chat. Should we release it this time? Because that's opposite. Should we bring it with us? Because I didn't feed it. I chose not to feed it to that bird in the park the last time. And instead got the kraken thing. So what should we do? Should we bring it with us and then feed it to the bird? Or just release it? Take it? Take, take, take. Okay, I'm seeing take. She's one of the best main characters. She's literally the cutest. She is too cute. Uh, oh, I almost clicked release it. Bring it with you. I'll keep it. Bring it with us in case we get hungry and we can eat it. Well, Miss Fortune does like sushi. Rodrigo, and she needs a new place to stay. All right, Rodrigo, you're coming with me. I wonder if Rodrigo has heard about sushi. <laughs> <laughs> it's like Rodrigo put in tiny pieces, you know? <laughs> All right. Let's do it. Oh, I forgot about this and part. And here we are, the house of George. I'm a bit nervous about introducing myself. You'll do fine, just... Don't mention the puppy like we discussed earlier. Yes, okay. I'll just dance. See what's that about this too? <laughs> Sparkle is um is from context clues the little kid went missing because we've also seen that blonde kid in the pictures right above my head. Um he is went missing. And all of these little kids are going missing probably because of Morgo. So this is a direct, like, cause and effect of what Morgo has been doing around. Knock or ring the bell? We rang the bell last time, right? So let's knock. I think we rang the bell. This next scene is, is, involves some heavy... Nobody's answering. I'll invite myself in. Heavy subject matter. Time to check out the party. Um, so there is, there is, uh, discussion of unaliving, so, fair warning. So yeah, there's, there's a crow in the background, there's a black bird in the background. I like his haircut. Hello? What is it, Miss Fortune? Nothing. How long has Morgo been around? Are you sure this is the right house? Where is the party? Hello. Okay. Excuse me, are you George? I don't know anything about any puppy, but it was promised a party. Oh no, wait. It looks like he hung himself. Hung himself? Like a piñata? Should I hit him like a piñata? No, Miss Fortune. He's dead. Dead? But he's wearing a pair of sweet boots. He, he can't be dead. Oh, okay. Hey, Miss Fortune, I think this party's over. Let's leave. I'll meet you in the back. George, you know, now that you're dead, your puppy is gone. I like the puppy. Bye. Sparkle. Shut up. Happiness to your 
And there's this beautiful drawing. This is not finished. Should we leave it or fix it? I don't know. Does this have any bearing on anything? If we leave it, does it do anything? Fix it? All right, we're fixing it. <laughs> Yay! I need you a doggy. Not that you need one, but anyways. <laughs> Not that you need one. All right. Oh, we can look at the crow too. Let's do it. It's a masterpiece. I agree. I agree, Roxy. <laughs> Freaking birds. Thanks to them, I obviously came late to the party. Okay, I'm here now. Let's go into the woods and get that eternal happiness. Yes. Someone said that I could complete the circle too. Oh, I love the woods with the trees and the birds and the animals. Dangerous animals, Miss Fortune. You might run into a fox. A fox? Like Benjamin? Like Benjamin? Yes, but all foxes are evil. So keep your eyes open. Uh, all right. <laughs> all right, let's do it. Also, I'm just gonna nerd out for a second. I'm gonna be the biology person for a second. Those are like mushrooms on the trees and stuff like that, but I don't know. One of the coolest... <laughs> I'm not gonna waste time on this. One of the coolest things uh, is you can tell if an environment is like generally healthy or untouched by pollution if there's lichen, something called lichen, which is like a fungus, I think, or like in the fungus family or something. And you, that's like that like scabby stuff that you see on trees. It's very cool. I think it's very cool. The mushrooms just reminded me of it. I'm gonna stop talking now. Hey. Uh, what's this? A doll? Everything begins with the song of a jackdaw. Everything begins with the song of a jackdaw. Is that the name oh, of the, the birds? Are they not crows? Or are jackdaws crows? Crows. Hey, what do you have there? Nothing. It cons it does not concern you, Mr. Voice. Oyster mushrooms. Oh, that's what the, the things are on the on the trees. They're very cool. I'm very interested. I'm, I love microbiology, but specifically, like fungi is, are so cool. Stay back, Miss Fortune. <gasps> what is it? A wild, dangerous fox. Wait, I recognize that black tail. It's Benjamin. It doesn't matter. Attack it before it kills you. Nah, I don't think Benjamin will kill me. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, is your name Benjamin? Do you want to play with me? Oh my god, dragon's oh, too. Let's go! Oh. <sighs> what a relief. Oh my god, thank Let's you so much. Let's keep playing my game. Okay. There's a magical cave. That is nearby. crazy. Thank you so you much. $50 for Benji. A magical cave? <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh man. Okay, so should we finish the, the things this time? It looks like Benjamin likes to paint. That's pretty cool. I like that in a box. I like that in a Focus, box. Miss Fortune. We need to keep going. Oh, okay. Just because you have a beautiful voice does not mean that you can tell me what to do. <laughs> is there a way to finish? Oh, I think there is. What's gonna happen? Why don't we just stay here? Why don't we just stay here? <laughs> is this the magical cave? It doesn't look that magical. Just wait until you go inside. Shut up. <laughs> Shut up. Bad. I don't. I have a question. What does this sign mean? Oh, I don't know. Sparkle? Ah, cool. So, whenever you're ready. I would be interested to see... I got everything, right? Wait, hold on. Let me stay in the forest just in case I can sparkle anything. I'd be interested to see if people have figured out. But then you won't find the eternal happiness. Oh, okay. I don't want it. Um, if people have figured out which one of these events and everything, like which one of the kids ended up being this poor child <laughs> drawing of an outline for the in the police thing. <gasps> this game is huge. Echo. <laughs> Well, let's explore the cave. Let's explore. Okay. 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 
I'm just joking. There was no echo. It was me. You're a real comedian, Miss Fortune. Thank you. Don't say that sarcastically. She is. She's hilarious and people love her. Um, the first time I heard this, I was going to make the joke, but I thought it was too stupid uh, from The Grinch where it's like, it's like, uh, hey, stop repeating what I'm saying. And then it repeats because it's an echo. And then he's like, you're an idiot. <laughs> oh, oh my God, I messed up the delivery. I gotta, I gotta work. I gotta work. Okay, this is all practice. Okay, just bear with me. I promise I can be funny. Please, there's so much pressure. <laughs> But it's the one where he screams out into this empty cave and he's like, I'm an idiot, trying to get the echo to say it back. But then the echo says back, you're an idiot. I've over explained this. I've beaten it too, too long. <laughs> it's really hard not to love misfortune. I know. I, I love her. She is. There goes the what hamster. That? What? Did I miss something? I'm not sure. <laughs> Miss Fortune, despite having all of these negative things around her, still has this innocence and positivity about about her, which makes you just love her so much because she's been through like more than an eight year old should go through in a life. So I'm a little lady, you know. All right. What's this? A hamster party? A magical. House nobody look. Party. Nobody look. Oh, I, I can't. <laughs> <laughs> I can't censor it with my hand. Can we go inside? I don't know. Let's go find out. Miss Fortune, I don't know that we should go inside. Let's talk about this for a second. <laughs> All right. Ooh, hamster fight. Are you going to do something about it? Uh, and the violence between the hamsters. We're going to choose no if we're doing the opposite of what we did before. So let's do it. To get involved in their drama. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> they went inside to party. I guess the hamster could hold their own. <laughs> it looks like someone spilled their cat. Oh my god! Ketchup. You know what? Maybe it is ketchup. No, 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 Miss Fortune. I know you're a little lady, but you should not. Oh my god. Don't take it. Don't do it. No. It just keeps getting more crazy. Wait, who are- are those all the kids that have gone missing? Or are those her dolls? And the dog! No, <laughs> the dog! Go away! Go away, blackbirds! <laughs> you didn't see the ketchup? Oh, look, they cleaned up the ketchup, so we no longer have to worry about it. Well, it's so nice. That wasn't an into refreshment at all. No, it was I tried to warn you. Miss Fortune. I'm okay. But we got a purse. We got a purse this time, so... Alright, let's look. X, X, X. <laughs> Talk about crazy. <laughs> Talk about crazy. <laughs> Alright, um, should we try and do this? Let's try and do this. Excuse me. Hold on, little lady, get inside. No, I'm not very important, you say? Okay. Can you believe this guy, Mr. Voice? No, I can't. We have to find another way out now. No, we don't. No, we don't. No, we don't. All right, I think what we have to do is we have to give the purse back to this lady. Check that lady out. I think she's in trouble. Oh, no. I think I recognize her. She's the owner of the club back there. Really? Yes. Looks like she was robbed. Oh, I bet it was that hamster with the black mask. Yes. I think you're right, right. Miss Fortune. <laughs> Excuse me. I think I have your purse. Yay! Oh my god, she's so nice! Lazy on the mint, though. I tried one and it was a wild ride. 
Is that for me? What is it? We got a VIP. Oh, live nude hamsters VIP. Fun. <laughs> That's your reward for returning the bag. A VIP ticket for the club. I get to party inside the club. Fancy. Fancy. Yes, and one step closer to the eternal happiness. <laughs> That's a win-win for me. <laughs> Alright, we get to actually go inside the club this time. Alright, should we go in? Should we go into the club? I don't know what's in this club, so I cannot tell you if there is some sort of warning that needs to be associated with it, but proceed at your own risk. <laughs> Excuse me, I'm a very VIP. Here's my ticket. <laughs> Finally, a real party. Whoa! <laughs> wow, this place is so sweet. This is crazy. Is this the VIP floor? Yes, you could say that. Am I allowed to dance? Of course you are. <laughs> sweet. Listen, Miss Fortune, <laughs> you need to find the white rabbit. Why? White rabbit? Why? It will lead you closer to the eternal happiness. Okay, I'll find it. All right, I guess we have to find a white rabbit. Hello. Ah, uh, you're cute. So cute. Is that strawberry juice? Mmm, yummy. <laughs> I don't think it's strawberry juice, Miss Fortune. All right. Excuse me, can you let me through? Hmm, okay. <laughs> oh no, Stoney! What are you doing? What is Stoney doing? What's happening? It looks like this hamster challenged Stoney to a dance battle. <laughs> no, we don't have time for this. I'm sorry, but it's on rock and roll, Stoney. <laughs> Nobody look. <laughs> Nobody look. <laughs> oh my God! Wait, what? Press left stick to match uh, direction and rhythm. Wait, what? I don't know what I'm doing. Am I doing this correctly? Oh, okay, okay, okay. It's this. I'm on fire. Hopefully not. Oops, I missed. Great. Oh my god, we get to do this with Stoney. Would it be a different with the unicorn? Super. I love you. I love you. I love her encouraging right. things. I need her voice actress <laughs> to just have these things in my day to day. I'm so bad at these rhythm games. Which is so funny because I used to, <laughs> used to play percussion. <laughs> okay, sorry. I can't stare at chat. I'm dancing. Shake that booty! Super! Yikes forever! Hey! Cute! Perfect! Sucky! Sweet! Great! Oh my god, it's getting intense! How did I miss that? Great! Sucky! Sweet moves! Slow! Shake that booty! I never thought I could be so sad that Miss Fortune says sucky to me. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. Oops, I missed it. Well, not my best performance. I didn't even get to see what Rock, what Stony was doing. Oh my God. Stony, those moves were awesome. I'm so proud of you. I'm sorry to interrupt, but we really need to get going. The eternal happiness is still out there. Don't you want it? Oh, yes. I really want it. Let's go. All right. Let's go. Um, we're just going to pass by this. Uh, just pay look at me right now. Just look at my face, please. <laughs> the white rabbit. Follow it. Yes. <laughs> She's so stylish. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Okay, we're just done. the other side of the screen. Listen, I know it must be hard not knowing much about our little lady's future. I'm not listening. Will Miss Fortune really die? If so, how will she die? And when? 
Will the evil fox kill her? Will she find the eternal happiness? I personally hope she does. <clears throat> Act normal. She's coming. Shut <laughs> up! Oh, Miss Fortune, you made it. Congratulations. Thank you. Where are we? We're one step closer to the grand prize of eternal happiness. Great, because I'm not allowed to be outside this lake, you know. Don't worry. It's not far from here. Great. <laughs> All right. If anyone deserves, like, actual eternal happiness, it is a <laughs> misfortune. Look, a missing kid. <laughs> All right, close. I don't like this. Maybe I should go back home. Besides, I didn't tell mommy I went outside. Bye. Don't go now, Miss Fortune. I can protect you. Really? Yes. All right, then. <laughs> All right, then. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> There's so many crows. Hello. Hello. <gasps> She's just gone. Is there no more dialogue? Ugh, smells like bullcrap. Miss Fortune, watch your language. <laughs> I swear there's so many things that are just going to become part of my vernacular now after Misfortune because she makes all of these things sound so incredibly cute. A unicycle. Get it? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Very clever, Misfortune. <laughs> Thank you. <sighs> okay. <gasps> Phantasmagoria is coming to open fields? That's so awesome! Maybe we could find time to check it out later. Who knows? Right. Don't play with my feelings now. Let's focus on finding the eternal happiness first. Then we'll see. All right. I can't wait. <laughs> <laughs> I would unironically love to go to Phantasmagoria. <laughs> Look, it's Benjamin from the Hoots in the Woods. <laughs> you know, if you ever want to hang out or something, I'm available. Don't engage with that wild fox. I told you, foxes are dangerous. Let me handle this. <laughs> and you? Are you a wild, dangerous fox? <gasps> no, thank you. Don't go. Let that wild beast run off. I don't want anything bad happening to you. All right. All right. All right, let's look at this. <laughs> ah, this is Benji's stuff. This is absolutely the best art I have ever seen. It's so personal. I didn't know Benjamin was so creative. Creative? That looks like a child has drawn it. What did you just say? Oh, I <laughs> didn't mean it like that. Huh. Hey, shouldn't we be focusing on finding the prize? I'm focused. I'm focused. All right. Um. Oh, okay, so the next sparkle is at the pet cemetery. Arrow said, I think. Slow down, you fuck! Miss Fortune. What? It <laughs> ah, <pfft. laughs> that surprised me again. App. Ah, She's too Are we cute. Going to the park? Yes. Okay. <laughs> I didn't realize I thought I went too far to the right. <laughs> so when she started talking again. <laughs> Mr. Voice? Yes, Miss Fortune? Has anyone reached the end of the game and gotten the eternal happiness? Yes, of course. I don't think there is an end. Happily ever after. That sounds nice. You know, I want to win this prize for my mommy. I wish I could give her some happiness. My sparkle doesn't work with her. Oh, that's really sweet of you. Thank you. Would you like to try my sparkle? That's not necessary. Ha, don't be silly. Here you go. Have a nice time, boys. Oh, well. Thank you. Anyway, let's go find the prize and make mommy proud. Yes. Um, someone pointed out they thought that the crows died every time he lies. Which I think could be the case. But it's interesting. I wonder why the crows die, because I know sometimes he uses them, like, intentionally. It says don't feed the birds and then a bird shows up. Oh, we can read the poetry, too. <gasps> There's a lot of sweet poetry written on the bench. Death is alive and it's eating from you. Sign and... Mm, interesting. What do you think? <clears throat> Miss Fortune, do you really need to read those 
poems. Um, okay, let's read the bench poems. <laughs> yeah, listen to this one. Both hanging too low. No signature. Where are they hanging from? Oh, look, a drawing of a cat. <laughs> Come on, Miss Fortune, let's go. All right. I'm totally not censoring. Oh, no, it's moved. <laughs> the bench does say Fran Bo, though. There's something that says Fran Bo on there, so. Oh my god. All right, <laughs> moving on. Look at the seagull. It looks like Kevin's dad. Who's that? He used to sit in the sandbox next to school. He didn't have any clothes on, and the police officer beat him with a stick. Fascinating. Remember that fish you picked up earlier? You mean Rodrigo? My fish friend forever? You should give it to the seagull. I'm sure it would appreciate some company. Hmm. I guess that maybe that will be a fair thing to maybe do. I guess. <laughs> All right, so are we giving the fish? Rodrigo, you won't be missed. Okay, bye-bye, Rodrigo. <laughs> oh my God. Oh, this fish brings you as much joy and love as it did to me. Aw. Very kind of you. Thank you. What? Oh no. Rodrigo is dead now. Of course. He was already dead. Seagulls love eating fish. Why didn't you say something? Well, now you know. Isn't it fun to learn? I guess so. <laughs> oh my goodness. I'll bury him later. Aw. <laughs> Alright, we have Rodrigo now. I love how she just absolutely, like, obliterated the seagull's face with Rodrigo. She, like, hit him in the face, and then Mr. Voice is like, that was such a really nice thing to do. <laughs> Poor Rodrigo. Would you like to ride the royal horse of the park? All right, let's ride. We ride at dawn. Royal horse, you say? I'm a little princess, you know. <laughs> she is too cute. Look at me. I'm on the horse. Hi, horsey, stop it. Oh. <laughs> oh, that was unfortunate. Are you all right? I'm okay. Are you worried because I'm such a little lady? Of course. You are really tiny and you could break. I broke my arm once. So you know what I mean. <laughs> The animation for that laugh is so funny. Check out that duck. Let's just go, Miss Fortune. You don't want to get involved with ducks. <laughs> don't be silly. Ducks are pretty cool. And look, he's carrying a boombox. This could be my opportunity to finally dance for reals. Would you like to show me some of your dance moves? All right, let's show him our dance skills because this is the opposite of what I did last time. Of course, check this out. Oh my goodness. Wait, stop. <laughs> it's okay, it's okay. That was unfortunate. What are you talking about? That was normal. Oh, if you say so. Aw, she had some sick dance moves though. Did you see her twirling around? Should we even do this one? Like I'll do to it. Write this one, it's like a tornado. <laughs> Ride the twister. Unfortunately, I'm yeah, too to to ride. <laughs> God, stop. I'm sorry, Miss Fortune. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, no, Miss Fortune. You're not allowed to laugh at Miss Fortune because you don't love her. <laughs> She's too cute. When the tree. Oh. When the trees are naked. When the wind is cold. When the smell of rotten apples smashes against the stone. <laughs> Listen, I promise the only reason I'm giggling... What are you talking about, Miss Fortune? Nothing. <laughs> the only reason I'm giggling at Miss Fortune is because she's just like me. <laughs> In terms of clumsiness and everything. So every time she falls down, it's just, it reminds me of me. Okay. This looks like the art of Benjamin, <laughs> don't you think? I think it's garbage, and it should be erased with fire. Really? I see great potential here. He's obviously very artistic. 
Just ignore it. Let's keep playing my game. The prize is closer than you think. Really? All right. Really? All right. <laughs> Mr. Boy's kind of slay, though. <laughs> Roxy. <laughs> he has an amazing uh, voice. I can almost feel the eternal happiness. Good. The last challenge awaits at the pet cemetery. A pet cemetery? That sounds like the best place to end the game. Exactly my thoughts. I don't think it's I'm ending this fortune, feel the unfortunately. <laughs> so, oh, I forgot I we have to do answer the voices or walking. answer the Mind if I questions. Ask a couple of questions. Sure, I'm pretty good at answering questions. Great, just answer as honestly as you can. All right. First question. Have you ever stolen anything? Okay, so this time we're going opposite, so we're gonna go yes. I stole my friend's Swiss army knife once. I felt so bad, I buried it in the yard and never told him. Oh, I'm so sorry for the both of you. <laughs> Second question, are you happy right now? Are we happy right now? Did we say yes before? I think we said yes before, so we're gonna say no. All right, so we're gonna just say no, we're not happy. Well, not really. Many things make me sad. That's why I want the price so much. Then I can stop pretending I'm always happy. Ah, I see. Well then, the last question. Do you feel loved? Oh my God, that made me so sad. Because that means that when she's smiling and walking around and everything, she's actually... Oh. Do we feel loved? I said yes the last time, so we're going to say no. No, that's why I like my Stony so much. He's just a rock and doesn't get angry or sad. I wish I could be like that sometimes. No. Thank you for your honesty. You're welcome. You don't want to oh. not feel emotion. At the pet cemetery. Even though negative emotions are hard. <laughs> All right, let's look at the missing kids. Oh, shake this out. More kids are missing. If I go missing, how will I tell mommy? You won't go missing. We'll go back home right after we find the prize. Ah, okay, nice. So that's Hero, I think, on the right hand side, because Hero has the same hat, even though he's wearing the alien mask every time we see him all the time so so she was pretending to be happy most of the time i think that's what she was basically saying which makes me really sad ready to find the prize of eternal happiness yes what is it i have hidden it in one of the graves i have to dig in a grave which one i'll give you a hint it's where the goldfish is buried the goldfish all right must I dig with my tiny hands? <laughs> Takes forever. No, use the shovel. What shovel? This shovel. Misfortune. It's so concerning. Uh, that shovel, okay. <laughs> that you see this and you're just like, oh, oh, that shovel, okay. <laughs> hey, was this here before? Look, this grave is available. What do you want to do? Oh, it wasn't here. Oh, so we can bury Rodrigo? Let's bury Rodrigo. Should we? Should we bury Rodrigo? Okay, we'll bury him. I think I'll bury Rodrigo here. He deserves it. <laughs> Any last words? Rodrigo smelled like a fish. I like that in a fish. Aww. He was nice. I hope he liked me. Bye, Rodrigo. I hope he liked me. That was beautiful. Thank you. Aw. I got an achievement for that. Rest in peace, Rodrigo. Rest in pieces. It says, Mr. Bubbles. Hmm. All right. I think they're the last one. Congratulations, Miss Fortune. You found the prize. <gasps> really? Yes. You see the little box? Open it. Oh, okay. Exciting. <laughs> Is this the prize? But there's only a note. What? Yes, it's... What? A... I stole your eternal happiness. I'm so surprised as Mr. Voice. It 
didn't. My eternal happiness. I knew the fox was trouble. No, he's he not. Stole your prize. Stop lying. A disappointment. I really wanted to surprise mommy with this. What should I do now? We must find the fox and get your happiness back. I'm sure he hasn't gone far away. Let's go find him. Yes, let's do that. Ah, oh, such a letdown. Okay, can I sparkle this now? I can! Oh, eternal happiness! Oh, misfortune. <gasps> Look, there he is, Benjamin. Did you steal my eternal happiness? Not cool. Uh oh. Come There's on, so many crows Benjamin. in the Did beyond. My happiness? Run after him. We can't let the fox get away again. He stole your prize. Benjamin really disappointed me. When unloved children in darkness <laughs> search for what they have lost, for why they're in pain. Okay. Children in pain? Oh. Did you find something, Miss Fortune? No, you're imagining things. <laughs> Gaslighting Queen! Gaslight girl boss gatekeep. <laughs> Only misfortune's allowed to, we to do that. Keep our eyes open in case we see the fox. They know how to hide. All right. So do you, Morgo. So do you. Goodness gracious. Oh, shake out this stone. It's different from regular stones. I'm telling you. I think you're right. All right, let's take oh. it. This piece is loose. I'll take it for me. Maybe it works somewhere else. Um, is this important? Should I not take this? I think I'm about uh, halfway that, through. That hole looks very much like where the fox would hide the prize. You mean I should go down there? Yes, don't worry. Nothing bad will happen. Nothing bad at all. Okay. You sound very sure. I'll trust you. <laughs> okay, should we go? I wonder why Benjamin will steal my prize. Maybe he's not happy himself. But I need that happiness myself. And for mommy. Hello? Anybody down there? <laughs> <laughs> Someone said too that Every time his fortune falls, since we know Morgo can like push oh, her around. That was a pretty big fall. <laughs> Hello? Mr. Voice, are you there? They thought maybe he's the one that's been pushing her around and making her fall the entire time, which makes me really sad. <laughs> Sweet, I found a needle in a haystack. <laughs> oh, damn. I dropped it. <laughs> oh. I know Morgo's not nice. I can't deny the bottle sweet style. I'll take it. Okay. So here, before I go into this next section, I can either use the fox repellent or not. The last time I did not use it. If we're doing opposite, should I use it? Even though I don't want to hurt poor little Benjamin. <laughs> Benjamin the cutie fox. <laughs> oh, there you are. What are you doing, Benjamin? <laughs> Benjamin does not look like there is a thought behind his eyes. He is so adorable. I'm seeing more people say to use it. All right, let's try it. <laughs> I'm sorry, Benjamin. <laughs> I'm so sorry for this, Benjamin. Oh my <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> What have I gotten myself into? <gasps> such a mess. I guess I should have known. Choosing her for this. I mean, I saw her eating glitter. Who does that? It's not natural. <laughs> oh no, did she? Miss Fortune. She You're threw up again? Well, that's great. Yeah, where am I? What happened? You sprayed fox repellent on yourself and passed out. <laughs> there was quite a lot of vomit, too. No! Yeah, yikes forever. That didn't go as I planned. <laughs> we still need to find a fox and take back the eternal happiness. Maybe we could find out where he lives. Yes. Give me a minute to figure this out and I'll get back to you. 
Okay, I'll just hang around. Oh man. I feel bad, I feel evil now. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> How dare he talk about her eating glitter? I know, right? Well, the soup, you know, with the animals. <laughs> Oh. I actually made a quick Google search. I found out that the fox has a cousin in the zoo. Oh, really? We could go and see if he knows where the fox lives. But how do we get to the zoo? It's like really far away. Why, we take the bus, of course. There should be a bus stop nearby. Ah, uh, okay. All right, let's go. Should I do this? He showed us this last time. Ooh. Familiar. What? Okay, let's look at this. Huh, how did I get to the town center? I carried you here. But how? You're just a voice in my head. <laughs> just a voice? No, I can do more than that, you know. Prove it. <laughs> I don't need to prove anything to you. Whatever you say, Mr. Voice. Fine. You really want to see what I can do? Uh, wait, my shoelace. Oh, wait, my shoelace. <laughs> if he can do that. There, did you see? I'm not just a voice in your head, Miss Fortune. Oh, what? Did you see? I'm sorry, I had a shoelace problem. <laughs> oh, let's just keep. Going then. Okay, so we can do juice, the ah, juice thing. Those people in the picture look so happy drinking their yields. Mommy brings me here all the time. It's really boring. Sometimes she sends me to buy cigarettes while she hugs strangers by the dumpster. Is that so? Mm hmm. At least she's only hugging them, I hope. man just dropped his wallet what do you want to do okay so if we're doing the bad thing then we steal it i mean not the bad thing if we're doing the opposite of what i did in my first playthrough then we steal it instead of return it so i don't want to do it uh fine i'm gonna take it it's for me let's do it open it all right i'm doing it do we get the same thing? There's just a picture inside. Really? Can I see? Mm-hmm. Aww. It must be his kid. What do you think? Sure. Why not? <laughs> I knew it. I'm such a clever little lady. Did we just doom the kid? It must be his kid. Oh, what do you oops. think? Sure. Why not? <laughs> I knew it. I'm such a clever little lady. Oh, there's crows literally everywhere in the background of the photo, too. I just realized. It is one of, I think it is one of the missing kids, right? It was one of the ones we saw at the pet Not, we didn't see him, but we saw the poster at the pet cemetery. These are the creepiest masks. It says, let's face it. Sometimes we're just too tired to smile. Use happy face and stop pretending. <laughs> okay. I know who owns this store. Who is it? Casey's dad. <laughs> Who's Casey? A friend from school. Haven't seen him for a while, though. Oh, wait. Is it because there was a story about how she spent the night? Why does he keep following me? Is he following me? There we go. One time, Mommy took me here and forgot me. I got to play inside all night until a security man found me. <laughs> he thought I was a raccoon. <laughs> Well, that sounds like it was a fun night for you. Yeah, except for me crying a lot, but it was fun. Imagining Miss Fortune in a little raccoon costume is so cute. <laughs> Aw, so cute. Oh my god, one of my favorite internet videos ever is the raccoon trying to wash his cotton candy, and he just goes, Look, even more missing children <laughs> posters. So many. I wonder what they're missing. Oh, don't you worry about them. I'm sure they will all turn up one day. You think so? Of course. I don't know, Mr. Voice. 
This is starting to smell mysterious. They're um all we've seen all of these kids so far. Oh, was I did I miss a sparkle? Here we are. Please have don't tell me I'm or please the bus all by yourself before. No, I haven't. I'm not sure what to do. Do I need a ticket? Let's find out. There's an information board. Alright, let's do it. Ah look, we have to wait two minutes. Yikes forever. Yikes I forever. I can't wait to meet Benjamin's cousin at the zoo. <laughs> I'm gonna tell how badly Benjamin behaved and that Benjamin should be ashamed. That sounds great. <laughs> okay, Air I see. The next sparkle is at the water fountain. Okay, so I don't... Okay, so it I can just interact. That all children under 15 years old can ride the bus for free. I'm eight, so I'm good. Great. Hmm. Now that I think about it, maybe you'll need a bus ticket. You sound old. <laughs> uh, I'm definitely older, but nobody can see me. About 10,000 years older. Like <laughs> yes, more or less. Hey, 20's not that old. Come on, <laughs> please. <laughs> Goodness gracious. <laughs> I'll see. I'm a bit tired from all the walking, you know. I can imagine. You have very small feet. <laughs> she does. Yes, I'm a little lady. That's what I am. Oh, man. Check those old ladies out. They're a little scary, don't you think? Honestly, I've seen worse. I'm sure you have, really? Mr. Yes. Voice. You know, my mommy also uses the same mask. She likes to hide her smile and tears behind it. Would you like to have a mask like that? Nah, maybe. I don't know. The bus is here. What's sad about that, too, is the mom hides both her smiles and her tears. So it's not just about, like, not showing uh, sadness. Hmm. This is this one of my favorite parts. <laughs> might take a while. Are you okay with that? It's okay. Hiro is keeping me company. Who is Hiro? He's my friend from Japan. He's a ghost, you know. He's always saying... <laughs> so people have told me that that funny. translates to there is no where is the fog, as I think. Ghosts. Hey, Miss Fortune, look, there's a bunch of cows on the field. Oh, I love cows. <laughs> oh, wow, look, so cute. So cute. <laughs> That was one of my favorite lines of hers. Oh, things seem to happen all the Run time. for your life, little baby cow! Next to zoo. I think we're getting close to the zoo now. Okay, great. <laughs> this type of hero is not funny, it's just cringy. Well, it's just here we are. the way that she you have the ticket says it is, is, like is so cute oh, and hilarious to me. Didn't I give you a ticket earlier? What? No, you didn't. Oh dear, I'm sorry. I totally forgot. <laughs> Do you have any ideas on how to get inside? You know, without paying. Hmm. I saw mommy showing her boobies to the guy in the store and she got some free food. But I haven't got any titties yet, so that might not work. I see. Well, I have an idea. What if we use diversion? Hmm. What does di diversion mean? Well, make the cashier look somewhere else, you know. Fool him. Okay, let me think what I can do. All right, so this time we can break the thing. Okay, this is breakable. Like, like with a rock or something. Like, like a stone. Okay, should we use it? Any tickets How can we to use the it? Zoo? Ew, yucky. No <laughs> tickets, only yucky. Only yucky. Hello. Can I get inside for free? Huh, I guess not. Huh, they know about the missing children here. Oh, I'm supposed to interact with this first. Huh, they know about the mi Hmm, I think I came up with an idea. What if... Okay, so we can either break the window or tell a lie. We told a lie last time, so I say we break a window this time. All right, let's break the window. What if I break the window over there and make a hell of a noise? <laughs> Did the game freeze? Wow, that's a wild idea, but I like it. 
Thank you. Oh, okay, it's back. <laughs> she wasn't talking for a second. All right, which stone to throw? Stony or runestone? Oh! We have the runestone. Well, what should we do? Does it matter? Should we throw the runestone since we've already read all of the other things in the other playthrough? There goes buy a car. <laughs> I'll do stony. Hopefully we can get him back. Okay, we got Stony back. It wasn't me. It wasn't me. It wasn't me. Don't worry about it. <laughs> I love how this guy, when he gets to his destination, just stands like, well, it's a problem. <laughs> Stony is more valuable. I'm sorry. Isn't this wonderful? <laughs> I made we the wrong choice. see so many caged animals. <laughs> caged animals? By the way, you did a great job not getting caught by the vendor. Very impressive. Oh, thank you. <laughs> but now, we should find out where the wolf exhibit is. Why? You mean Benjamin's cousin is a wolf? Yes. Remember, he knows where the fox lives. All right. All right. All right, let's go, Miss Fortune. Okay, so the next one is the fountain that we can do. Good. Dirty now, Mom. <laughs> oh, what? What did you just say to me? Give yourself a fuck. <laughs> oh, Miss Fortune, watch that mouth. Miss Fortune! I don't care. This bird is mean. Oh, dear. We need to get your happiness back as soon as possible. I don't like Mr. Voice. I think I've said that like 10,000 times. All right, I'm going to pass by these birds since we got the dialogue before. Um, If that's okay with everyone. You know? I'm feeling really annoyed, like a lot. What's happening to me? I smell hormones waking up inside you. What? Hormones? No. Hormones. Ah, oh, okay. What's that? Your body's preparing to create life inside you. You get a lot of new feelings that are completely normal. Ah, oh, okay. And you'll bleed for three to five days from your vagina. Ew, yikes forever. <laughs> yikes forever. Each month for many, many years. And society treats you like garbage. Are you for real? Yes, I am. I think I need some emergency glitter. We all need emergency glitter. Ah, so much better. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> uh... Okay, let's do the glitter. Yay! <laughs> Yikes forever. I wish I could write Japanese so I could send a cute postcard to my friend Hira. But where does a ghost live? Stop lying, Miss Fortune. Ghosts are not real. You're just jealous because you don't have a ghost oh, friend. Sorry. Can I use the stone here? Ah, look at those sweet flashes. They could be all my babies. Don't get too <laughs> attached those toys don't worry i'm just looking can we do it again ah look at those uh, be all my baby. don't get too attached those toys don't worry i'm just looking i wish you could use the um stone <laughs> to get a toy for misfortune wait so. misfortune we don't know where the wolf is maybe we can find a map or something to find the wolf you say yes misfortune ah uh, okay okay let's go back and go to the map Oh no! <laughs> I didn't even think about that. This fortune will be stuck like this forever. Aww. <laughs> Whoa, so much to see and do. Find the wolf area so we know where to go. I think the zoo is about to close. Okay. There we go. There. You see? That's the wolf thing. Great job. <laughs> Let's hurry up now. All right. Wolf time. Mr. Voice is implying she wishes to steal the toys. Yeah. I think part of it too is like, she, he's acting kind of like her guardian in this. This looks like the way to the wolf. Yes. Let's go then. And so sometimes he'll say things like, oh, we can't afford it. Or like, we can't do this. Kind of like a parent would do if they can't get the toys, you know, for the child. So it's like furthering that. Oh my. Parent Looks like this relationship. Parent to the public. Oh, damn it. 
You will have to sneak past the janitor to get to the other side. Don't let her see you. Otherwise, she will lock you in and call your mommy. Ah, uh, don't worry. I'm like a sweet little ninja. Okay. You could hide behind those boxes, right? Great idea. Hide behind a box until she turns her back to you. All right, I'm ready. Let's do this. So what I'm gonna do this time is get caught because I'm really curious because this lady is a crow. Oops. <laughs> like a little ninja lady. Well, Our little ninja lady. Now, wait her. for her to turn her back to you. And then kill her from behind? What? <laughs> That's another one of my favorite what? lines. That's what the ninjas do in movies. I've seen like all of them. Don't tell mommy. Well, this isn't a movie, so just do as I say. When she turns around, you can jump out and keep moving. <laughs> All right then. Just look a lot cooler on TV. <laughs> Quick, Stony Killer. <laughs> oh my goodness. Ah, oh, damn it! My ninja move failed. What is she gonna do? Do I just have to start the sequence again? Oh. Oh man, we got caught by the cops. <laughs> we should get out of here and find the wolf. All right. Okay, so we just start here immediately. Okay, so how do I? The code is. Oh wait. Don't get out of here. Wait. I want to see the doll. All right. Well, maybe I can come back. Oh no, we are locked inside. We need to find a key. Look around. All right. Okay, now I can look at things. Okay, so we're gonna look here. Do I smell tea? Bounce. It is so much faster, yeah. Is there a key in here? Cool, another doll. When broken hearts are chosen to receive the gift from the beyond. A gift, you say? A gift, you say? What's that? Nothing. <laughs> I like how Miss Fortune is smart enough to not tell um, or, or huh, Mr. Voice about secret the dolls. Fancy. Okay, I have to find the code. It's in the jacket pocket, I think. I'll check those pockets. Yeah. Check out my computer skills. I bet the password is this one. Wait, Miss Fortune. I think you're holding the paper upside down. Don't interrupt me. I know what I'm doing. Keep okay. quiet. Some people were confused as to like how Miss Fortune knew and why like the code is uh, 5468. It's because there's this six written here that points to the nine. And then he says, oh, it's written upside down. And she's like, oh, I know what I'm doing. And so I just trusted Miss Fortune. And I was like, okay, so this could either have been a two, but I was like, oh, yeah, it's more like five. So like five, four, six or five, four, nine, eight. That's what I did. Anyway. <laughs> Five. Oh, six. Wait. I just embarrassed myself. Five, four, six, eight. I said to trust Miss Fortune and I didn't. Five, four, six, eight. There we go. Oh, yeah. Miss Fortune <laughs> Ramirez Hernandez is a computer scientist. You really surprised me. She didn't surprise me. I can tell she's smart. A private shot. <laughs> Let's Jerk. see what it says. Okay, I'm not gonna read the whole thing again. Uh, two seven. Code. <laughs> Talk about crazy. Two seven five eight one is the code. Two seven five eight one. Let's put it in. Two seven five eight one. There we go. Yeah, for the whole game, you were really careful to find all the dolls because you thought you could fight Morgo at the end. I mean, technically, yes, there's the a fight scene. Lady. I got the key. I think I got all the dolls in the well first one. Done, in the first time I played through it. Very impressive. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I love her so much. I love her so much. Time to find the wolf. And if we get lucky, I'll put it. <laughs> Aw. Look, we found the wolf. Yes, and there's a note. It must say where the fox lives. We need to take it. I can reach it from here. See if you can get inside. All right, we can get inside. Uh, uh huh. Time to meet the wolf. <laughs> <laughs> come, Wolfie, come. <laughs> 
I wonder if this is a plan for Morgo to get another child by like letting the wolf loose and the wolf gets loose and like finds a live child. Ah, oh, damn it. What scared him away? Why can't a little lady suspect the wolf? Oh, that was unexpected. Not to me. Animals usually run away from me. That's too bad. But hey, the note is right there. I'm gonna take it. Okay, let's take it. <laughs> evil cousin's address. My evil cousin's address. Fox Spooks Digan 15. Open fields. I wonder if that's the same handwriting the as Mr. Address. Voices. Good. Now we can get that stolen happiness back. All right, sweet. It looks like the fastest way to the fox is by boat from Phantasmagoria. Wait a minute. Are you telling me we are going to Phantasmagoria? Woo! Yes. Sweet. I always wanted to go. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> We're doing it. <gasps> Also, Air, I see your message. Look at the wolf. <laughs> for another round of questions while we walk. Sure. My question answering skills are all warm up. Great. Great. And, as usual, just be honest and you'll do fine. <laughs> First question. Have you ever heard this question before? Okay, so this time... I said no the last time, and this time we're going to say yes. One, because it's the truth, and one, because... I'm doing the opposite, so. Yes. All right. Second question. Have you ever lied to a friend? He just moved on. Have I ever lied to a friend? Did we say yes before or did we say no? I can't remember. I think I said no. So I'm going to say yes this time. I'm going to say yes. All the time in school. Charlene still believes my daddy comes and picks me up after school. I just walk behind the trees and sneak home when she's not watching. That's so sad. If you say so. Now, for the last question. Have you ever seen someone die? So we said yes before. It'd be interesting. I feel like I'm, I feel like I want to play it again. Um, cause I said, I'm, I'm gonna say no this time to see what the dialogue is, cause I said yes the last time, but it's interesting because, like, we saw something the last time we played it, and if he's talking to us, the player... Other than in ninja movies? No. <laughs> they die in funny ways in ninja movies. Don't tell mommy. I won't. Thank you for your honesty again, Miss Fortune. <laughs> You're welcome. We're getting really close to Phantasmagoria now. Yeah, I can hear. <laughs> Exciting. Aw, oh my goodness. <laughs> wow, this looks like the creepiest place to ever exist. So scary. I wish I had a ticket to ride, though. Really? But hey, what's that falling just in front of you? Please, don't play with my feelings. It can't be a ticket. Are you sure? It looks like a ticket to me. It can't be, but I'll check it out. But I'll check it out. Okay, let's do it. What? A ticket? For real? <laughs> Sweet and spooky. <laughs> Thank you. I love her. You're welcome, Miss Fortune. Now, let's go find a boat to the fox, remember? Mm-hmm. Okay. Um, we can glitter this. Yay, it's so nice and happy now. <laughs> Hopefully, yeah. I'm trying to I'm trying to be as vigilant as I can be. Oh, to get the better ending. I love balloons. Just so you know that I love balloons. <laughs> okay, Miss Fortune. <laughs> oh, the other thing I noticed when I was editing. Oh, okay, I'll point it out. I noticed something when I was editing and making shorts and stuff like that about this next scene. I'll show you guys. Hey, you, from the other side, Miss Fortune deserves to Look at this red time. balloon. So try to make the right choices for her, all right? Okay, did you take note, the red balloon being released? Hmm, I just <laughs> have one ticket, so I can just ride one ride. Okay, I'm we can only do one ride. First. All right. Okay. 
<laughs> the big legs scared me, like jump scared me the first time I did this. <laughs> Once I saw a documentary on TV about hot dogs. And now I don't want to eat hot dogs. <laughs> some hot dogs are really good. And some <gasps> oh my god, that scared me again. Sorry about that. I was just trying to pull your leg. If you do it one more time, I'll just shut my eyes tight and see nothing. This is the problem with streaming is I get distracted trying to like talk, <laughs> trying to read chat. And that scared me again, even though I played through this section before. Oh my God. All the random people are the same as she goes. It's like dreams, how you see the faces. Oh, that's a really good observation, Idol Outlaw. Because if he's creating this world, oh, I have to glitter this. <laughs> Her drawings are the cutest. Check out those sweet unicorns. Is this the ride you want to spend your ticket on? Uh, no, because we did did this the last time. Not sure yet. I'm gonna look around more. Okay. So. <laughs> the mean children at school say that I have a pumpkin head. I can see the resemblance. The what? Nothing. Huh, okay. He's so mean to her. Ah, oh, the smell of freshly made candy is delightful. Ah, oh, yes. Too bad we can't afford any. There's some candy on the ground. I could use the party hat to make <gasps> my own mixed candy cone. Come on, Miss Fortune. Don't even think about it. I'm doing it. Ugh. Are you really gonna eat some? <laughs> is she going to? It's new. Hopefully she didn't get sick. She's probably gonna get sick, but yeah, eat the candy. Of course, it's free candy. Delicious. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> she has a cavity. <laughs> oh my god, no, there's there's cigarette butts in it. No, <laughs> Miss Fortune and pills. <gasps> there's like one piece of candy in that. There's like one. What did I do? Miss Fortune, <laughs> no! <gasps> Benjamin? Oh my god. Wait, that's a doll. What is it, Miss Fortune? I don't know. I think the candy made me feel bad. Well, I told you not to eat it. Yeah, that's true. Silly me. I didn't know we would get that. Oh, that's still Miss Fortune. <laughs> <sighs> Much better. I'm. S that was the most intense scene. Are those um, orchestrated by Mr. Voice? Because with Benjamin taking her out and everything. Oh my god. Everything she does is so sad. That was, that was like not even, all the other ones started out happy and then became sad. That was just sad from the get-go. Incredibly sad. I'm sorry. The dolls were her parents? Yeah, well at least, um, it was interesting because one of Benjamin's dolls replaced um, her dad in the thing. Oh, sweet. There we go. The haunted house must be terrifying. Is this the ride you want to spend your ticket on? Let's do it. Yes. All right then, have a pleasant ride. Oh no, she looks so nervous. <laughs> Who put saws in a horror house? Aww. <laughs> oh no! There's aliens in the back.
Oh no, she got sick again. <laughs> I don't feel so good. I'm feeling this. Oh no. I don't want to. But the Roy went too fast. It was fun. Alright, good. Take a deep breath <laughs> and you'll soon feel better. <sighs> okay. Good, good. Now, let's go find that boat. That boat. <gasps> Okay, I'm okay. Okay, I didn't miss any sparkles, right? I hope not. Happiness to misfortune! Okay, let's continue. You did the horror house the first playthrough? Oh, there's Hero. Hero. Um, yeah, I had thought about that. I had thought about that the first time I played, because she does seem to like, like oh, horror-filled things. there's a bunch of games here. Can I play one? Oh, of course, you must play one before we leave on the boat. I just <laughs> love it here, don't you? Who <laughs> doesn't? I want to play a game now. This one is free. I want to play it. Oh, please do play it. Play it as much as you want. Really? All right. Well, check this out. <laughs> now with real bullets. <laughs> Be careful, Miss Fortune. <laughs> Fonse. <laughs> I, I think I broke the game. I think you might have. Like <laughs> All right, let's continue. Check this out. Okay, now you guys get to see. This took me forever. <laughs> Please, go ahead. I can't wait to see what it's about. <laughs> All right, let's do it. Are these tiny foxes like Benjamin? They're dangerous foxes. No, they're not. They they're adorable. Eternal happiness. Is this not a cute fox? Them. Whack them. Okay. Okay. Boing. <laughs> all right, all right. I gotta show my skills, which are non-existent, but somehow. Boing. Oops. Boing. Okay, okay. I'm getting better at it. So we can get a total of nine yes, tickets. Great whacking misfortune play again yes because I want to get some of the other things we have to at least get one for the ticket Sorry. to ride across Boing. Oops. Boing. there we go oops no. <laughs> I still get a ticket though uh, look at this small tiny adorable box that's what I'm saying Oh, I don't outlaw in terms of the spirit animal thing. I think uh, Benji is the spirit animal, right? Wasn't there something that said spirit animal like later on, like in the house or something? Uh, we're gonna see what we can get with these five tickets. We can get four more total. I remember <laughs> when I recorded this, it was so funny because I realized that you could get more than one ticket and I didn't know how many you could get. I didn't know that there were just nine. So I was just sitting here like blank faced, like, okay, all right, I don't know how long we're gonna be in for this ride. But there were a couple times where I didn't get the prize either, so <laughs> I played it probably like too many times. <laughs> Mr. Voice, can I get a balloon? Because my mommy never gave me one, so maybe you can give me one. Well, you know we can't afford it. Remember the red balloon I pointed out? What's that? A floating balloon. It's coming back again. Is it for me? Yes. Okay, <laughs> thank you. I hate to think, though, that um, he only did this so that this scene could happen. Uh, here's my luck. Oh, Miss Fortune, I'm sorry about the balloon. Don't worry. Thank you anyway. Benji is the main character in the next game? Yeah, that's what I think. I don't know if Miss Fortune is going to be in it. I don't know. I hope she is, because I like uh, Benji and Miss Fortune a lot. Okay. Check those sweet rewards. A golden Oh my god, there's a stone hat this time. A tiny hat and a doll. Oh, sweet. Let's see what I can get. Okay, so let's get the ticket. That or the, coin looks the ticket. Delicious. I'll take that. We'll get the coin and we'll get the doll. And I also want to get the stone. Oh, one of those dolls I can. <laughs> I want it. What an oddly specific decor to have in a vending machine. Did you choose? Nothing. Okay, I'm gonna go back and get one more ticket so we can get the stone hat. But, ooh! Wait. Happiness! Um, 
Yay, I'm glad I saw that, otherwise I, I would have missed it. Um, but I'm not gonna bother with a fortune teller because I don't think it's gonna be any different. Check this boat out. It's like a black swan. How cool is that? Really, really cool. Tell me about it. Anyway, this boat will take you where you need to go. You mean to Benjamin's house? Yes, and it's just one golden coin. I got this sweet chocolate coin reward. Is that good? I <laughs> don't think that would... No, see, it's fine. Oh, look at that. Well, are you ready to leave? This is going to be so cool. I hope we don't get attacked by virus, though. <laughs> or the Kraken. What's a Kraken? So this has got to well, be different because we don't have Rodrigo know. this time. But tell me, I'm curious now. We don't have time for that, Miss Fortune. Just forget it. Ugh, but now I'll think about it forever. Ugh. Idle Outlaw. <clears throat> I was thinking about the River Styx the first time I played it. I didn't say anything because I didn't want it to be true. If you appear in front of me, I will see you. And if I see you, I will know it is you. I also thought maybe. I'll wait until Misfortune's done. Hey, this place is very quiet. Is one allowed to talk? <laughs> anyway, I was thinking, is the Kraken available for petting? You know, like uh, some pet doggies, some pet kitties. I want to pet the Kraken if it's possible. Well, I heard you could lure it out with fish. With fish, you say? Well, the only fish I know is buried. Hey, Mysterious, are you taking me now to the house of Benjamin? You know, that blue-eyed, soft, fluffy fox <laughs> who happens to be a great She has the biggest crush on Benjamin ever. Happiness? Okay, bye, Chloe. Thanks for stopping by stream. And why is that you collect coins? That's how you pay for your rent and food, right? Miss Fortune, just leave him alone. No, he won't go here. <laughs> anyway, do you like to eat sushi? I know about sushi because I have a Japanese ghost friend. By the way, can you speak Japanese? I need some translations. Do you know what this means? Kiribadoku desuka. So you don't know, huh? You know, I've never been outside this late by myself. Do you go outside by yourself this late? Every day? Are you going to eat my chocolate coin? Because I'm a bit hungry. Ah, uh, stop talking! Ah, why should I stop talking? Nobody else is talking. Hey, Mysterious, where are you going? No. Oh, look, can he swim? Hello? That's what happens when little ladies ask too many questions. He's so mean to her. To he shows his true colors. Ah, stop it. I'm pretty sure he'll be fine. <laughs> Look, he's a skeleton. He doesn't have lungs. He'll be fine. <laughs> the music says it all. Yeah. <sighs> this is when it gets really creepy. Oh, the thing I was saying before that I didn't want to interrupt misfortune with is um, <laughs> happiness is that um, I figured maybe it could just be connected to Phantasmagoria instead of like, I mean, it's it's a metaphor, obviously. Um, and I know that for sure now, but um, I thought maybe it was connected because it's like a spooky thing, you know, with the horror fest that was going on. <gasps> Check that out. It's the toy graveyard, I'm telling you. Whatever you say, Miss Fortune. <laughs> I like how she managed to have at least some crush on someone before the eternal happiness. Yeah, but it's like Ara said, who doesn't have a crush on cute little Benjamin? Benji. Mr. Voice, are you there? Hello? There's something wrong here. Something very wrong. What's wrong, Mr. Voice? What do you mean? It's coming. Hide. Hide. I don't know what you're playing, but if you scare me, I'll close my eyes. So before I do this part, should I get caught by the hand? What does chat say? Because in this next part, something shows up and tries to capture Misfortune and I was able to get away before. But the thing is, is I don't want to skip over any of the sparkle sequences. So if it skips over the sparkle sequences, then I don't want to. 
So you guys want me to get caught? The hand? Okay. Oh, I can save beforehand? Oh my god! Wait! <laughs> I forgot! I haven't saved! The toys are innocence lost from the previous victim. <gasps> oh my god! Wait, Logan, you're so right because he made us pick a toy, a singular toy, to take with us. Stony, that's what Stony is for this time. The toys are the innocence lost from the previous victims, but yeah. Oh man. Check this out, Stony. This is your family, see? From the woods. <laughs> and now, say bye bye, baby Stony, because we're leaving. Say bye bye, baby Stony. I love it. Oh, oh, damn it. My little foot got stuck. Okay. It's the monster, Mr. Voice. Can you see? Do I actually have unlimited time, Goria? Oh. All right, I'll try. I'll try to get caught. Duh, duh. Gosh, you're taking forever, Morgo. Oh, maybe I do have unlimited time. <laughs> I'm just sitting here, jamming to the music. Okay, should we go? All right, it's making me do it. I think it's making me do it. Sorry, my keyboard is so loud. It's right next to my microphone. <laughs> it got closer this time though. Was the fox. No, it wasn't. It was you! It was you. Again. You're mean. You don't know what you're talking about. Yes, he has huge I hands. I saw it. Okay. Oh, should we get up or play dead don't this time? Any sudden moves. Even though my heart is saying get up, I'm gonna play dead just because I haven't seen this option before. He's poking us with a stick. <laughs> Don't touch her with your oh. paws, you beast. Stop it. You're scaring him away. Bye, Benji. Bye, Benjamin. <laughs> They're too cute. No paws, just stick, yeah. <laughs> There's something I need to tell you. If you keep running, you'll end up badly hurt, and I don't want that. You're too important. But I want to find Benjamin. He was nice to me. Trust me. He's <laughs> dangerous. Stop running, please. I know, I don't get to hold a soft and sweet pause. Okay, so uh, I kept running the last time. We saw what happened there. I'm gonna stop and listen to Mr. Voice, because we'll also get more dialogue, I think. All right. Oh. Thank you. That could have ended badly. Now, watch your step. There's a bear trap up ahead. You don't want to get stuck in one of those. Hurts like hell. Who will leave a bear trap here? He's gotten stuck I in one before. Bears. Well, I don't <laughs> want to point any fingers, but it was obviously the fox. Obviously, it was not the fox. Like the fox. I, I know you don't. I call foxophobia. Is that true? Yes, I swear. Now, let's focus on the eternal happiness again. <laughs> All right. All right. Yay! <laughs> Happiness to the bear trap. Oh, we can also do the stone here, should we? This one looks like the other one that didn't look like the other ones. You see? Yes. So you know. Yes. Does it make a difference um, if I have the stone at the end of the playthrough? Or if I wait for it to get stuck? But I want to see if there's any differences. So, Miss Fortune, I have a couple of questions for you. Are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Yeah. Wonderful. Now, just be honest and think about it before answering. First question. Do you believe in magic? I said yes the last time. I think. Didn't I? I think I did. Because that's what I would have said. <laughs> so let's do no. No. That is said the only magic came from acid. But the only acid I know is when I like butter. <laughs> you shouldn't do that. Hmm. At either question. one of those do things. You trust me. <laughs> do you trust? I said no the last time, so we're gonna say yes, I guess. Even though I don't. 
I guess I can only hear you in my head, and I trust my own head, so yeah. <laughs> that makes me so happy to hear, Miss Fortune. Well, anyway, now for the third question. Are you afraid of dying? Am I afraid of dying, yes or no? I said yes the last time, so we're gonna say no. No, I'm not afraid of death because all, all, all dead people I know never came back from being dead. So it must be pretty cool to be dead. Oh. <laughs> well, I guess you'll find out when you die. Shut up, boys. <laughs> be quiet. Looks like there's going to be a storm. Oh no, I hope it doesn't rain that much. I don't like my feet getting wet. I'm a little lady, you know. I know, Miss Fortune. <laughs> hey, look at that. I think we're here. Benjamin. Stay cool, Miss Fortune. I'm cool. I've got an eye I'm cool. out here. I'm One fine. Can go inside and look for clues. I'm sure that the fox has hidden the eternal happiness. <laughs> Make love sure the, fox. the cabin is empty. And if you see the fox, run. All right. So, uh, Garaya, I see your message. The doll only appears if the stone gets stuck, so did I make a mistake? Oh, it looks like Benjamin's good at cutting Do I need wood. the dolls or just he the glitter so for muscular. the end? Because I got all the dolls the last time. I'm pretty sure it's just, I think it's just the glitter. Be brave, Miss Fortune. Be brave, Miss Fortune. Okay, I will look around. Maybe I can find my eternal happiness. If Benjamin has it, I ask him to share that prize with us, and everything will be fine. Okay, I remember one of the glitters was using this. Whoa, a video player. Bonsu. Just the glitter? Okay, okay, that's good. Let's see. Benjamin's on TV? <laughs> <laughs> Is that the monster? Damn it, I broke Benjamin's tape. Okay, and now we can glitter. Maybe I can fix it. Happiness to the video player! <laughs> Happiness to the video player! Yay! Can I do it again? Yay! Okay, so this time we're gonna respect uh, Benjamin's privacy. Is that Benjamin's diary? The fox's bag after leaving the cabin. Got it. <laughs> Thank you. All right, this time we're going to respect it. We read through it the last time. I will spy on Benjamin's personal stuff. Um, and I think I'm going to skip over the T, even though it's a cutscene. Or maybe I shouldn't. The upside of being a spirit animal. Music. Um, should I? Is it going to be a different cutscene? Oh, man. Mmm. That tea smells like roses and lemon. I bet it's called Benjamin's Blend. Because I can almost smell his boss blending the ingredients. Maybe I should try it out. Should we do it? Should we do it? Alright, we're gonna drink it. We're gonna see the cutscene. Mmm. It definitely tastes like his fluffy boss. <laughs> Mmm, delicious. She literally makes him sound so adorable. Oh, I mean, he I is. Feel weird. Okay, it's the same. I was just curious if it was any different since we didn't read Benjamin's diary. <laughs> it's so funny watching this scene again. Because the way Benjamin is staring at us with all the flies and everything, it's like slightly unsettling to watch this. And the way it keeps zooming in on them. I was I was like watching it and I was like, uh, should I be I mean it was cute, but at the same time like slightly disturbing in some ways. <laughs> oh man. Sorry, Miss Fortune. Oh, I'm so sorry. Peanut butter? Peanut what? butter? Oh. <laughs> Alright, let's go. <gasps> Benjamin, I'm really sorry I broke your video player. There are the mushrooms. But you stole the, the eternal happiness. It was promised to me if I beat the game. <laughs> I really want it back. We can totally share it if you want. 
Christian too Are many times is the answer. Benjamin? Don't worry. You can hold my hand if you want to. Oh, what are you? Is this a kiss? <laughs> is this really happening? Are we going to kiss that? right now? Is that your diary? You want me to read it? Oh is God. that what you're afraid of? I think I saw him too. Okay. You can't hide the children. Oh, uh, follow Benjamin or stay in the cabin. Last time we followed Benjamin, and if I'm doing the opposite, we gotta stay in the cabin. I'm not supposed to follow you. I'm sorry. You! You are the one taking the children, aren't you? Don't you come any closer. She's facing him. I like to play forever. Mr. Royce? <gasps> Don't hurt- <laughs> Don't hurt her! So she discovered it was Mr. Boyce. Aww. <laughs> Benjamin, I'm scared, so I came down, okay? Was that red there before? The red line? There's a hole behind the painting. Hello? <laughs> Hello? Uh-huh. Such a clever little baby. <laughs> Don't forget the glitter. Did I forget the glitter? Did I forget glitter for something? Not yet, right? Use my ninja skills. <laughs> oh my god. A bad crack. <laughs> Be quiet. This is a ninja mission. <laughs> I wonder how they uh, recorded I'm those ninja. voice. Are you <laughs> that that soundtrack. Um okay, so there's the there's all of this stuff. Let's go up here. There we go. Hmm, a picture of a key. Interesting. My ninja senses are telling me to climb up on this <laughs> chair. I love how she says ninja. Ninja. Okay. Hmm. A real ninja lady always touches everything. Oh, I had to outlaw. You're so a right. Button. The, um... The the farts are because of the tea. I didn't make that connection the first time. Push the button? Yes. All right, then. I push the button. <laughs> All right. All right. Time to find Benji. Oh. oh, that was unfortunate. I hope things get better when I get the eternal happiness. When I tell you... Misfortune. What's the next dish? The first time I played through the sequence and I realized I'm going to move my mic since my get keyboard up, is so loud. When I saw the sequence for the first time, it almost made me cry. You are stronger than you think. That we have to help her up and she's, it's so, ugh. You've been knocked down before. You've been knocked down before. Did you let that stop you? No, you did it, Miss Fortune. You got this. Get up, Miss Fortune. You can do it. Come on. We all believe because. in you. Because. 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 You are the little lady, Miss Fortune. Yeah, you are Miss Fortune. I love her so much. Oh my god. It almost made me cry the first time I watched it. Okay, I'm out again. Anyone here? <laughs> Mr. Voice? I guess I'm alone. Okay, we gotta pet the deer. Because oh, I want to. A baby deer. So sweet. <laughs> mm, dream come true. <laughs> I'm petting the baby deer. <laughs> I had to. Can I sparkle it? No. Happiness to the deer! 
Is that Benjamin's bag? Benjamin? Are you around? <laughs> he must be in trouble. I'm very disappointed in you, Miss Fortune. Listen to me carefully. When I say I don't care, Mr. Voice. I Benjamin. I think he's in trouble. Didn't you hear what I just said? I'm very disappointed. I don't know. All I hear when you Mr. talk, Mr. Boy, Voice, is... Please, stop playing games. You have lied to me all the time, and that's very sucky. I trusted you. <laughs> what are you talking about? Benjamin I will glitter the bag. really clear with a picture he showed me. You're the one taking the children, and I... I'm not the hero of this game, right? I guess the eternal happiness was all a lie. Stop this nonsense. We have to keep playing my game. You can't make me. Yes, I can. Stop that. Then hey, play Morgo. with me. Morgo. Need to Come find here. Morgo. Come here. Happiness. I'll give you a clue. It's at home. <laughs> Waiting for you. I'm sick of that eternal happiness. I don't want it anymore. You can't say that. That would break the rules. You heard me. I don't want the eternal happiness anymore. I won't tolerate this behavior. I'll be waiting for you at home. Okay, Mom, so this is the... Tell me where Benjamin is. What do you do to him? Last spot. Freaking monster. <laughs> Catch these hands, Morgo. Morgo, I will be your karma. Don't you touch Miss Fortune. I helped her get up and I will keep her up. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Let's see what's inside. Maybe a clue where to find Benjamin. Yeah, Mr. Voice and Benji are the only ones that can see him. Oh wait, <laughs> is this not the cutest? Is that Benjamin as a baby? <laughs> so cute. <laughs> okay, we'll get the doll. At the end of the road, you will realize you already signed the deal. <laughs> More goes a sweet cape, we're outmatched. Well, I mean, you have a point. <laughs> Okay, um, I will pull this up, but we already, I already read through the entirety of it. Basically what this is saying is like, Benji is a guardian animal coming to help this parasitic creature, or help stop this parasitic creature called Morgo, who we learn is Mr. Voice. That's, you know, the arc that we just went through. Um, and he's here to help Little Miss Fortune. So. All right, and happiness to the thing. Okay, I got an achievement for sparkle, which tells me that I think I got all of the sparkles. So that means that we did a good job this time. Lo-fi beats to carry souls into the afterlife. Yeah. <laughs> was Benjamin born with the earphones? Probably. He was a cool fox all from right. the beginning. I guess I'll take the train back home. <laughs> <laughs> okay I'm just gonna go straight to the train because we're so close to being done and I want to see what the ending is okay I'll wait here waiting waiting for a little while this is one of my favorite scenes okay I'm gonna talk to myself bye Azaria so Miss Fortune how have you been? Okay, I have this, like, weird day. I saw monsters, I saw dolls, I saw Benjamin, and then I went to the zoo and everything was everywhere. And then I realized Mr. Voice had lied to me a lot. And he took Benjamin, and now I'm alone. I don't like being alone. Wow, sounds like you had one hell of a day, Miss Fortune. The train is here! It was a nice chat, Miss Fortune. <laughs> Talk to you later. You go, girl. <laughs> you go, girl. I love her. <laughs> and there's Hero. Hero. <laughs> it is too cute. Okay. Uh, I wish I had my coloring book with me. So uh. that's different. Oh, we just skipped straight to it. I didn't recognize you. <laughs> Such a coincidence that you're on the same train as me. You know, I had a big fight with the silly voice in my head. I get the feeling that Mr. Voice is not who he says he is. 
Have you ever heard voices in your head? Oh my god! The thing shows up! I know I'm touching here. his armpit. What does it mean? Hey! It's the stop! Monster. Leave Hera alone! I'm misfortunate, sorry. Toskata? <laughs> Help Hero or cover our eyes. So the last time I helped Hero, even though I want to help him again, I'm doing the opposite. So cover your eyes. Yeah, beware the consequences. Oh, I feel so bad. Yeah, I don't know why Hero has a mask. Has, has that ever been discussed? That's so sad. That's good. It means help me. I'm, oh, I feel bad that we didn't help him this time. Oh man. Oh, also, kitten collector, don't worry about it at all. I totally understand. Have fun on your birthday. Now I have to walk all the way back home alone. This is the last time I follow a voice in my head. If Benjamin was here, he would walk with me. <laughs> okay, let's go. Let's go, little misfortune. I feel so bad for her. Also, okay, so like, I... <laughs> because I edited the, um... I'll just play it. Excuse me. These teens don't here. see us at all. Well, if that's how you treat little ladies... Then give yourself a fuck. There are hints, like, everywhere. So, he's just a fan of the content. It's an alien mask. But he was a little confused, yeah. <laughs> hey, it could be. It could be canon, maybe, in a different universe. Alright. Also, seeing the tire hey, tracks down at the bottom. The Is that a goma gum? That's so sad. Oh, and there's no cat food. It's just a beer bottle. Oh yeah, aliens and cowboys, Garaya, because he had a cowboy hat on. Mmm, that's interesting. We got red lights. I like them. Oh, also, hi, Camilla. Welcome to the stream. I'm back. Hello. Miss Fortune, you don't notice anything wrong about this house. <laughs> What's that sound, Benji? I want to see what happens, too, if we don't hide. If we try and go the opposite way this time. Hello? Mommy? Benji? What happened here? Congratulations. You reached the end of my game. Leave me alone. I'm looking for Mommy and Benjamin. Aww. There's no eternal happiness for you. I don't even care anymore. Of course you care. You know your mommy needs it. It's your responsibility. No, yeah, it's not. I guess you're right. Good. Good. Ready for a new game? If I play alone, will you give me back Benjamin? I guess I will. But only if you truly commit to the game. Okay. Splendid. You will love my new game. And here we go again. This is Miss Andrea. Fortune. I think that's. She's a wonderful. I think child. that's what happened, a unfortunately. Nice wonderful family. A little sparkle for you, and a little sparkle for you. <laughs> Wait a minute. Wait Didn't a I minute. What? No, you're not doing this correctly. I don't Can care. You say something about me, <laughs> Marco is Which gaslighting. Is not yeah. True, by the way? <clears throat> Wait. Stop talking, please. Are we going to play another game, or is? This like what? I don't understand. If you can reach the end of the game, I'll give you eternal happiness. And then you say deal, and I say yes. Stop ruining this! Mm, eternal happiness? No deal! Wonderful. Fantastic. Ready to... wait. What? No deal. No. No. How about this? What if the fox was waiting for you in the hallway? If the game is about Benjamin, <laughs> you leaving me alone, I'll play along. Sure, sure. I promise. You know the way. So the other thing that I think is interesting is um, Little Misfortune 
can it said in the in the this is what's sorry i'm trying to in the uh pages that benji had in his bag the like exposition dump or whatever it said that only certain people can see and hear benji and morgo and so the fact that little miss fortune seems to be the only one who can hear miss uh morgo tells me that maybe she has some supernatural abilities like uh, even more so than like the other children and, and everything so okay we're going okay. in okay i'm just gonna play his game one last time people blame miss fortune in this what how can you blame miss fortune she's eight <laughs> she's eight how could she know there's a framed picture of a car, too. Oh hey, Jose, welcome to stream. <laughs> oh, was there, a, was there a crow out the oh, window no, this time? Not again. You promised he wouldn't be like last time. That was a beautiful example of cause and effect. Ma, you lied to me. I don't <laughs> want to play this game anymore. Fine. Let me come up with a new game to play. Game. Knock knock. Who's there? No, I don't want to play with you anymore. Knock knock. Who's there? You're I want to see what happens if I go down it. towards the right, Let so I'm going to do that. I can't get out. What happens if I wait? Is anything going to happen? Who's there? <laughs> Sounds very British. What happened here? My secret spot. He won't find me in there. Who's there? <laughs> it's so goofy. Nothing happens? Okay. Open this door, right? Oh, now. she's holding Stony this time. We have a new game to play. No, I told you already. I don't want to play with you anymore. Oh, Stony, teach me how to be brave. So now we're playing hide and seek. I love that game. No, leave me alone. All right. Just the so stony line know, hit me hard too. My game <laughs> is the only thing keeping you alive. Is that one more of your life? I will throw like stony at him. I wish we could. Can we? Can do about it. Will you please stop talking about that fox? He's been <laughs> trying to take you away from me all the time, and his ugly paintings. Ugh. Oh no, you don't talk like that about my Benjamin. You know what? I'm done with you. I want you to leave. Right now. You don't have a clue about what's going on. This is not the last game you play with me, Miss Fortune. This is only the beginning. She said no! Go away! You silly little child. Another toy for my collection. Oh my god. <laughs> he grows. You're mine to play with for eternity. I'm sick of you being a bully. Pull, You'll stand up to him. Benjamin will come back and save me. No, we may. <laughs> I like how she's just sitting there. Cross the path, and now you're mine. Benji! Woo woo woo! Benjamin. I love you, Benji. <laughs> <laughs> get here? I love it. <sighs> There's nothing you can do. She belongs to me. She belongs to Benji. <laughs> <laughs> that symbol. Scrawny instead of beefy. Ah, I could see that. No. No. <laughs> the amount of people that were like lusting over Morgo <laughs> in the comments. <laughs> it was interesting. It was interesting to see. <laughs> His skull was on the wall next to the frame picture of the car. Was it? Be aware. Hmm. 
He's strong from all the souls he's consumed. That's another good point, Idol. Idol Outlaw. Is Daily everything back to normal now? Benjamin, save me. Benji, are you around? Okay. Marco is coming. Open your eyes. He's the voice in your head <laughs> driving you mad. Well, now I know what to call Mr. Voice. Okay. And then I think I've interacted with everything else. Except for this? Benjamin, did you go outside? Aww. Benjamin, where are you? I'm not ready. Oh, the vase is still broken. Ugh. Talk about causing my fuck. Sorry. Sorry, Miss Fortune. I didn't know that was gonna happen. <laughs> Alright. Still October 11th. I don't wanna... I don't wanna go. Wait, so this isn't any different so far. Mommy! I'm back. Mommy, who need to know me? Are you angry because I couldn't get the happiness for you? What's happening? Mommy? No, oh, no, don't cry, Miss Fortune. <laughs> must be a bad dream. Is that... You know what breaks my heart about this scene? Is Miss Fortune says, what have I done? And then earlier she's like, are you mad at me because I didn't get you the eternal happiness? It's heartbreaking. And her little glitter, they didn't have to add her glitter. <laughs> That's so sad. Taking me somewhere else because I have nothing against it, but I have to talk with my mommy first. Okay. Mommy, I'm going to go somewhere else. With Bangi, okay? He's the fox that I like. I'm a little lady, you know? That's what I am. <laughs> I guess I was your little misfortune for a while. But you need to find your own happiness now. I love you forever. Aww. <laughs> Benji is the best. Benji is the best. He's helping our little misfortune through this. Can we go back at all and talk to our mom again? Oh, wow. Okay. Misfortune isn't smiling anymore. She isn't pretending to be happy. Wait. 
Benji, okay, stop. we're here. Benjamin, where are we going? Benji? <laughs> Benji wipe material. <laughs> I love Benji. His little boots. Oh, puppy! I'm so happy to see you again. Oh, <laughs> when Where I tell you, <laughs> the first time I saw this, seeing the puppy again, it was a roller coaster. Oh, Aww. and he has his party up. He's not flat anymore. <laughs> Dragon's tooth don't remind me. Oh my Aww. goodness. A worm grim reaper? I didn't get to see that closely last time. The puppy's name? Sure. Little cutie, aww. <laughs> so why do keep things keep showing up with the lightning strikes though? These are references to Fran Bell. Is it showing that they're going to be connected in a future game? In Benji's game or whatever? Oh, this place is really cold. That also made me really sad. <laughs> Alright. I think we got all the sparkles, so... Aww, her little heart. Sparkling lady. Wait, so the good end isn't her? Okay. <laughs> All around disasters. This isn't any different. To disappear deep inside the fog. You defeat him. Is it different after she leaves? Or after she goes I in? Guess Mr. Boy's game is over now. Benji? I love Benji. Who are you? I'm a little lady. Miss Fortune. That's who I am. Lady Miss Fortune? Yes, you could say that. Good. Step inside. Her voice is so You're soothing. Expecting you. Aww. What is this place? <laughs> Last line. The sparkles. I think that last line hits me because it's back Oh Oh we get to see her Eternal happiness Oh the game we got the eternal happiness for her mom but not for misfortune or maybe for misfortune maybe it's with benji oh wow what a sad game <laughs>
That's incredibly sad. Um, the last line when she goes into the the cave or whatever, and she goes, what is this place? It's the reason why it's so sad to me is because it's like death is such a mystery. And when the people that you love, or even characters, right? Like, because you get attached to, I mean, there is, when you fall in love with something or someone and it's gone, it's like you don't know what happens after that. And so it's just such a beautiful way of implying that there is something afterwards. And it's magical. Because it, it felt positive, her voice acting, the way that it was done. When she goes, what is this place? But we don't get to see it because we're still alive. We're still playing the game. So it's sad. Eternal happiness for mommy. Yeah, that uh, name of the achievement, that was the name of the achievement that you got for getting that ending. I guess it's a better ending. I hope that if they do another game, we get to see Miss Fortune and know that she's okay in more than this way, <laughs> you know? So, it's sad too because even if Morgo wasn't like canonically her dad or whatever, which I've seen that theory going around, he did kind of act like a father figure to her. And for him to just betray her at the end is just like, come on, dude. Like, you can tell Ms. Fortune has had a rough time and you're just making it worse. Can I do a Ms. Fortune impression? I don't know. Happiness to the chat. Happiness. <laughs> I wish I had glitter to throw at you guys, but then I would have to clean it up. So um, just know I, I'm incredibly grateful. This has been a lot of fun. Um, if you found me through TikTok or for, through YouTube or anything like that, um, I really appreciate you being here. On that note, I'm going to say farewell, friends. Thank you so much for being here. Remember, we're not alone out there, and I will see you in another stream. Bye-bye. <laughs> Bye, guys. Happiness to the stream.